And we're sharing the story of a single mom who says faulty appliances, heat problems, and a roach infestation sent her running from her apartment. She told News 4's Ashley Moss now she's stuck paying rent for two different places because she's locked into a lease she can't get out of. They had told me that this unit was the Airbnb, um, that it was kind of listed regularly, it was good, it had been remodeled. But this um, Oklahoma yeah, transplant's plans for a fresh start quickly became a nightmare. For months, she's had to deal with broken appliances, bad insulation, and faulty heating and cooling units. I have to leave my oven open. I have a space heater for my living room. Then there are the roaches. They're all right there. Naturally, she's thought about leaving. They want three times the three times the rent and to keep my security deposit or I could get an eviction, which no one wants an eviction on their stuff. Cassandra can't afford to break her lease, but with two small children and another on the way, she can't afford to stay. So she found a new apartment and is now paying two rents. I work two jobs to afford just to afford to get into my new apartment. I don't want any other single mom in the situation where I'm in. Oklahoma is one of six states without landlord retaliation protection. A bill that could have added tenant rights during the 2023 legislative session did not make it to the Senate floor. We've been able to make progress towards strengthening tenant protection laws, but we still have a lot of work to do. Cassandra's apartment is in Representative Mickey Dolan's district. It makes Oklahoma a vulnerable state where these predatory landlords can take advantage of low income tenants and not have to face repercussions. In the meantime, this mom is grateful. I feel relieved that I do have a new home to go to. Also anxious. But I'm still very upset that I have to continue to pay this. In Oklahoma City, Ashley Moss, Oklahoma News 4. Ashley, thank you so much. Cassandra hopes her story will help others exercise extra caution before signing a lease. A 2022 update to Oklahoma's Landlord and Tenant Act means renters in Oklahoma can deduct up to one month's rent for repairs that aren't otherwise being made. You can read more about that over on our website, kfor.com.